week-long youth cultural festival. This, the, this is the day we're opening it. It's going to be virtual. Uh, one of the things that we're doing is we're tapping into the gifts and honoring the gifts of our young people. And this, the reason why this started is because uh, throughout this pandemic experience, we have. Uh, one of the reasons why we're doing this is because through the pandemic we've been working with chiefs, we've been working with ministers and governments and then throughout this exchange we forgot the young people because they were there also, they were not in school, they were away from their peers and I know there's been a lot of emotional, mental issues that they've had to deal with. So I was uh, approached by my brother Bernie Spence who is here today, he had a dream. And in that dream, I was in a group of people and they were acknowledging me and shaking my hand as they often do when I'm in a crowd. So uh, he came to me with a dream and in, a, in that dream, he saw me being greeted by these people and we were walking together. And, uh, but there was one young person that called out to me and that young person said, you forgot about us. You forgot about us. And he shared with me this dream and it shook me to the core. And I sat down with our team and I said, we have to do something. We have to reach out to our young people from 12 years old to 17 years old, a forgotten demographic. So we were opening up uh, a festival so they can showcase their gifts and honor their gifts. On, on certain days, there's gonna be dancing and there's gonna be, uh, performances through music, however they want to present themselves. There's going to be painting and uh, regalia making and also poetry and writing. Beadwork. And beadwork. So this is all happening all week and we'll be showcasing them on our MPKO uh, social media. We'll be able to celebrate and enjoy our young people. And I've been looking at those uh, uh, for the past two days and it brings a joy to my heart. So I want to thank all the young people for stepping up because they're very talented. I'm very proud of them and I'm very proud that we are able to do this. We've had a lot of sponsors. People have contributed and we're going to mention those sponsors that have given, some have given 35,000, some have given 20,000, some have given 10,000 to this vision. And I want to thank my brother Bernie because it would have not happen if he did not come with to me with that dream. So I want to give him a special presentation. Bernie, just to say thank you for being a brother to me, but also thank you for, for sharing that dream with me. So thank you, my brother, for uh, giving me the vision and the dream. This is why this is happening because of that dream. You have chosen to share that dream and our team got together and we did something with this dream. And for the whole week, we'll be having our youth cultural festival, honoring our gifts, celebration of our youth. So thank you very much. Okay. Uh